Hi Capricorn, it's Tuesday. We're going to do your love reading real quick. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. It is general, as you know. Will not resonate for everyone. Let's see what we've got going so far. I think I am going to try and do a full reading with these cards. You know, I'm still I'm still learning them. So, and, and they're really advanced. So, um, I've been using them for the pre-shuffle, but I think I'm going to try and do a spread with your spread with them. So we'll see. But um, so amazing already, powerful Empress. This is pre-shuffle. So Empress energy that's nurturing, healing. This came out last, but um, I layered it with this one. And then we also have, you guys might be in a twin flame journey. If you are, you might want to check out my extendeds. Um, but this is four of wands, 1111. And look at this, the devil card. Tied, chained, bound, can't let go. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. You don't have to stay with the twin flame if it's not um, good for you, okay? And you can also take comfort in knowing that you're connected and, you know, in, on another realm in another lifetime. Um, so maybe that will help you. Anyway, I'm not saying you're not going to be with them. I'm just saying, because this is union. Union, Capricorn. All right. But look at this new beginning. New beginning. The Fool. The Fool is a fresh start. Empress energy. I mean, look how beautiful those go together. Nice, right? Okay, let's go ahead and get started. How are you? I hope you're well. I hope you guys are. Well, thank you for visiting. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, I love you. Pray for you guys every day. Hope you guys are praying with, for each other with me. Um, I love to read your comments and hear where you're watching from, even if you just want to say hi. Um, hmm. um, anyway, so the, you, if you want to join in on the group manifestation where we, and if anybody wants to help me out with responding to some of those comments, I think I'm getting carpal tunnel, but <laughs> in the Leo, um, reading in the comments, we're doing a group manifestation where we all help each other manifest. And I literally go into every comment and write the intention for you also. And, um, you know, um, help you manifest and I still will but if anybody wants to join in on responding to some of those comments that would be amazing I spent almost two hours doing it today responding to those okay it was felt pretty pretty darn good though let me tell you okay so wow nine of cups your overall energy ten of pentacles Wow, self-love. Nine of Cups is being okay on your own, not needing someone to complete you, being your own cake. Okay, your current energy, Seven of Cups. Interesting. That is options, keeping your options open. Wow, here's the um, Emperor. No, now we definitely have, I mean, we've got Four of Wands, so we've got Twin Flame. Um, indication with that and then we also have Emperor Empress okay my dog is being she's trying to get my attention I hope she didn't interrupt us too much your person's energy Ace of Cups that's very nice oh they're feeling tied and bound too so they're tied and bound to something I wonder what it is why do I feel karma why do I feel karma Recent, I don't know why I'm even shuffling again, but recent past, let me grab it. Knight of Pentacles. Somebody was moving too slow, maybe. Oh, gosh. Wow. Okay. A little slippery. Let me grab those. I'm going to put them back because there's too many. Well, they are layered. Let's see. Eight of Pentacles. No, Page of Pentacles. Yeah, look at that. Maybe an apology. Maybe um, too slow to communicate. And it looks like somebody walked away. See that Eight of pen eight of Cups? That's, you know, climbing over those spilled cups and moving on is what it looks like. But those cups do represent love. So it's not like there wasn't any emotion there. 
and then we have four of pentacles but not letting go and okay so this is all about something that ended or needs needed to end but there's still that feeling of not letting go okay isn't that amazing super cool cards so let's look at um let's look at them let's see no 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 you have to wait so cute. She's giving me the whole head tilt thing. You can wait. <clears throat> oh, wow. Okay, so this is moon, but it's emotions, but look, it's moon, so it's, you know, so what's in the dark or hidden emotions, maybe, but it's also got that all-seeing eye. Isn't that crazy? Crazy little twist there. And look what came with it. The devil card again. How beautiful. No. No. I hope you guys, that's not annoying you as much as it is me. Um, oh gosh, she's giving me the look. So somebody is tied by, I don't know, emotions by, let's see. The Empress again. Empress, Emperor, Empress. What is, look at that. What is the all-seeing eye, though? Okay, I'm sorry, you guys. I don't know this deck very well. Um, that's amazing, though. Let's see. Twin Flame. And we have Union. But what's this outcome? What's the outcome here? We can pull it all together also with a um, Oracle. Oh, <gasps> equal give and take. Wow. This is happening. This is happening, you guys. Don't settle for this person not treating you right, but it looks like, let's dive in a little deeper. This is two of cups, equal give and take. Somebody won't let go. There's too much love, too much emotion, but this Empress energy is so key to this story. It came out twice. Well, the Emperor did too, but I mean, wow, divine masculine, divine feminine. But this Empress, this is, Empress energy is all about self-love. Self knowing your value so in other words that is probably going to be the driving factor of what brings us together not settling and i'm going to give you my little speech real quick okay whenever you feel like you're not being honored or valued it is often a really really deep a really good indication of you know by someone else it's a really good indication of what of how you're not showing up for yourself. So it's kind of hard to expect other people to show up for us if we're not showing up for your, ourselves, right? When we show up for ourselves, we take care of our bodies. We, you know, dress, we, we pre look presentable and we walk, walk a certain way and talk a certain way and, and just really truly be that person that we're striving to be if we act that out, if we work out. Once we start showing up for ourselves, other people show up for you. It just comes naturally. You don't have to manipulate it. It just happens. That's key here. But yeah, you've got a union all over the place here. Wow. But I, my point is don't stay with someone that's not treating you well. Um, because it looks like that's what is going to bring this together. Somebody, people don't return and start treating us better when we let let them return and not treat us better. You know what I mean? But it all starts with self self love. You guys it does look like you're in a twin flame journey, and that journey is all about self love. It's not, well, I'll give more to you know help carry their weight. It's not that doesn't work. That doesn't balance it out. It actually makes it more unbalanced. Um, so again, slow moving, but not able to let go. Scales are going to be balanced. I want to see real quick. Let me see something real quick. Real quick. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. We're almost done. We're going to pull an oracle that's going to, these oracles have been absolutely amazing. We're also going to pull a manifestation card. We had Hierophant in the beginning, remember, with that tree? And that's about marriage. So, 
Things are, yeah, oh my gosh, things are balancing out. Oh my gosh. Is this even real? Okay, I don't know why we're even, why I'm even feeling sorry for you. I guess, I guess because things haven't been equal in the past, but it's coming back around. For those of you who are thinking, I don't want the same person, then you've got someone new coming. But the strongest energy here is justice is happening. Balance, things are going to be balanced out. And I'm going to say it again. It's not going to happen by you pulling their weight and you doing all the work. It is not going to happen like that. It's going to happen because they have to step up to the level that you are on. Not any other way. You can always pull someone back and bring them back. But until it happens the right way, it's it's harder and harder to recover each time. So this is happening. This person is going to step up, but you are going to have to insist on it being correct. They're going to have to act like your emperor for you to be their empress. No, no doubts, okay? That's just the way it's got to be. All right, Capricorn, I love you guys very, very much. Let me know in the comments, and I will see you soon. Love you guys. Bye, Cappy.